after working and saving, I went to New York City and I uh, went to fashion merchandising school, okay. which was Peerless Studio. And at that time, you could have a two-year college and you could really do many things. Today, of course, you need a PhD in order to get a job. And I was employed by B. Altman and Company of New York City, Fifth Avenue and 34th Street, which was one of the best known department stores in the country. And I was, uh, I went through the stages of learning and finally was assigned to the executive training program. Wow. And from that program, I was made a buyer. And at that time, I was a pioneer because people of color were not buyers in big department stores. Gotcha. When we ran into the civil rights problems and what was to be done in the country, uh, the Vice President of Human Resources, then the, and, and our Chief Executive Officer, decided that I was the person who should come to the Human Resources because it meant that there had to be someone who could go to all of the meetings that were planned, uh, go places and find young people like you who were interested in, and tell them about merchandising. So I traveled most of the black colleges okay. and spoke to students because they would not have had the opportunity to go into department stores and find out anything in those days. Right. So now it's t a totally different situation and we pioneered uh, so many young people. That's awesome. Well, I think that people are always going to judge me because how I look, but that won't really matter to me because I'm going to try to do my best and achieve my goals in life, and I'm going to, I'm going to be successful, mm -hmm. and I'm not going to let anyone stop me mm -hmm. because that's who I am. That's, that's how I'm going to be. People kept just laughing at me because I was different, and I just, like, said, well, you're different too. Like, exactly. we're all different, and that's what makes us unique. That's right. My passion, for the most part, is people. Like, I like engaging with people. I like learning um, different things. I'm currently um, a student and um, at Manchester Community College, and I'm going back to school for occupational therapy. One of the most important things that I wish to say to young people like you make sure that you get your education. Because what I did, and we're talking uh, 80 years ago, it won't work today. You have got to have the college degree. Mm. Two years of college is not recognized anymore. You have got to go to a four-year school. You have got to have that degree. And you need even more, depending on what you choose to do in your lifetime. Mm. Think about what you're going to do, and then that's your goal, and you must work towards it.